Twix learns the back stall. Step 1. Train your dog to stand on the platform. Lay down flat on the floor and hold the platform on your back. Decrease your criteria and accept a paw on the platform. Good boy, come on. Yay! Keep shaping until your dog will jump up with yeah. all four paws. Yeah. Good. Good job, buddy. And down. Stand. Down. Stand. Remove the platform. Decrease your criteria and click for one, two, three, or four paws on your back. At this stage, you should be rewarding for effort. Go back to using the platform if your dog is not understanding. Add another cue that your dog knows. Yes. Wait, stay, or stop. Yes. That was it. <laughs> Don't be greedy. It is okay to accept effort. And down. Yes! I'll take it. I'm gonna take it. That was good. And down. Yes! <laughs> that was so proud. Lay on a footstool to add height and to help you remain somewhat stable for your dog. Yes! Off! Oh, awesome! Add duration. Off! Oh, yes! Add criteria and an off cue if you want. You could use a release cue instead. Kneel on the ground with one knee and balance with the other foot on the ground. Make your back as flat as possible. Yes! Yes! Start working on the trick in new locations. Decrease your criteria. Get the behavior before asking for more. Increase criteria and yes! move to a kneeling position. Stand with your legs in a staggered stance for balance. Make your back as flat as possible. Okay, pause up. Down. Off. Pause up. Yes. Very nice. Beautiful. Increase your criteria by working on different positions on your back, duration, and different angled approaches. In my Tosser Dog DVD, Canine Freestyle Collides with Disc Dogging, you will learn how to use this trick as a transition move combined with other tricks and how to use it in a routine. Bloopers. Good. Pause, wait. Good boy, pause. Come on. Over. You need to go pause it? You need to back it up? Back up. 